On Tuesday, October 29th, a ribbon cutting event was held at Mullins Elementary to reveal their brand new playground equipment for all ages. Faculty are thrilled to have this new handicap accessible equipment to help enrich their students recess and the students themselves are fans of it too. Mullins Elementary Principal Amy Rhodes tells us more about it. Our students are very excited. They keep asking every day how much longer, how much longer and they saw that everything was finished and today several have asked can they get out there. They're so excited. So, but we wanted our our Head Start and preschool students to be the first to use it uh, since a portion of that is for our Head Start and preschool students. Um, currently our Head Start and preschool are housed at Johns Creek Elementary because we don't have enough space so with the construction that's going on here uh, we're getting eight new classrooms so that will be completed in time for school the 25-26 school year and we'll be able to bring those Head Start and preschool students back here to Mullins where, uh, where they should be. And so we wanted them to be the first to play on their part of the playground today. At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. With 40 years of being in the hearing care industry, you'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. This new playground was acquired thanks to the Mullins Elementary Head Start program and the Board of Education. Rhodes says the morale at Mullins has increased since its installation. The smaller part, the addition for the younger children was funded through our Head Start program. Uh, and that was in part with uh, Mr. Jenkins that was here today and our Pike County Head Start and Preschool program. And then the other part of the playground was something that our uh, Board of Education members and uh, had voted to uh, put that in for our older students so that they would have something equivalent to to play on as well and to have something to do when they do outside recess. Anytime you get something new, they're excited and uh, to be able to get out while it's still pretty outside and sunshine, but I think they're all very appreciative of the added space and the, the playground equipment, the new cafeteria, and the, they feel like they're eating in a restaurant. We've had lots of good feedback, so the students are very, students and staff morale definitely has increased. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.